grown man business. All right, we got another episode of Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. All right, we got a uh, got some bad news, man. I'm gonna talk about some injuries. I'm gonna talk about some suspensions. All right, I got on Miami Heat uh, hat. You know, it's one of my newest edition, one of my newest hats. And I'm gonna talk about basketball after these videos here. So come on over to Red Go Sports Talk. This is Red Goes One, where we talk about strictly football. I'm gonna talk about Ray Allen over there in Red Go Sports Talk. I'm trying to come back into the league, and we're gonna discuss that. But let's talk about some injuries. Um, all right, I'm gonna start with Denver Broncos. My boy, my team, my boy. Uh, this was gonna be his uh, breakout year for the Denver, Denver Broncos. Uh, Vance Walker. Look like he will be out for the rest of the whole year. Preseason and regular season of 2016. He had tore his uh, right ACL yesterday, Monday, in, in uh, practice. And uh, look like he's going to be out, man. It's a major hit. Uh, he was expected to earn the starting position to replace uh, Malik Jackson. We know we lost Malik Jackson to... Uh, Jacksonville Jaguars, he signed a big fat contract with the Jaguars in the offseason. And uh, Vance uh, uh, Walker was going to be his replacement. So uh, we still got a couple other guys who could fill that slot, but he was, uh, he has, he was, he has some promising, uh, a promising future, man. He was looking good in that position. Uh, just a major, major, major hit, man, for the defense uh, end for the fans and for the whole team, you know. So we just got to bounce back and um, get some guys filled in that, that position. But, yeah, uh, Vance Walker, he's out with a right ACL tear. And uh, he'll be out for the whole season. Um, Dallas Cowboys, Ezekiel Elliott, my boy, Big Zeke. Uh, he's been out for a couple weeks now. You know, it's, I'm just now doing the report about it. I was watching him closely. Uh, it wasn't nothing serious, just a, a hamstring injury. Uh, I think he'd been out for like a month. It looked like he'll be expected uh, to return to practice any day now. So we're just going to keep an eye on that. I've just been watching, watching it closely and silently to see if, uh, you know, what's going on with him. Uh, for the Buffalo Bills, outside linebacker, Big Shaq, Shaq Lawson. Rookie Shaq Lawson came from uh, Clemson. Uh, he looked like he'll be out for a couple weeks in the regular season. You know, he had just had surgery on his uh, left shoulder. Is it left shoulder? Well, sh shoulder surgery. Uh, so shoulder surgery. I don't know what shoulder it was exactly, but uh, look like he he'll be out for a couple weeks. Probably turn around October uh, week six, I believe. So uh, that's a major hit as well, and. Along with Shaq Lawson for the Buffalo Bills, the inside linebacker Reggie Raglan, <clears throat> he has a torn ACL and it looked like he'll be uh, out for the rest of the season as well. So it's been a lot of injuries going on in uh, in the uh, in in training camp and in the preseason, man. Uh, who else should I talk about? Well, I got some more Buffalo Bills talk after this. I'm gonna end this video now because I don't want to be too long. But, uh, yeah, let's talk about this, man. You know, we lost uh, Vance Walker, uh, defensive end for Bron uh, Denver Broncos. <sighs> yeah, it, tore ACL. I hate that, man. Ezekiel Elliott, Elliott looks like he's going to be fine. Uh, he just have a hamstring. He'll, he'll return. He, he expected to return any day now. Shaq Lawson is going to be out for a couple weeks. Return in uh, week six. Had so uh, shoulder surgery, and Reggie Raglan, he looked like he'd be out for the whole season with that ACL tear. It's been a lot of ACL injuries going on right now. So tell me what y'all think. Let's talk about this. I'm upset, man. We lost one of our one of our boys, man. You know, but he's gonna be all right. Denver's gonna be all right. Grown man business. <laughs>